Hello friends, here is uh, problem number 12. Before going to the problem number 12, I will read the given direction. The direction is complete the following numbers of figural series by choosing the correct answer from the given alternatives. So here they have given number series 113, 114, 118, question mark, 143, 168. And we have to find this missing number. This is a series formed by numbers using some logic behind the series and we have to find this missing number. The given options are 127, 129, 134, 139. So these are the given options. So how you are going to find the answer? Yes, first consider the given question and then use trial and error technique. Use uh, like uh, taking difference between the neighboring numbers or uh, going with uh, some uh, multiplication, obtaining the uh, next number using the previous number with some multiplicands. So this is called trial and error technique. Use some basic mathematical operations on the neighboring numbers. Try to find the relationship between uh, the neighboring numbers or the logic behind the given series. So that will give you the missing number. And finally, match the answer with the given options. Whichever it matches, that option will be the right option. Now, I will consider the given question. The question is 113, 114, 118, question mark, 143, 168. So this is the given question. So now what I will do? I will take difference of neighboring numbers. I will subtract 114 in 130 or 114 minus 130. You have to just take difference. 114 minus 113 is yes. 114 minus 130 will give me 1. Moving to next numbers. 118 minus 114. 118 minus 140. Yes, it is 4. Next, here I'm having question mark. I can't get difference. Leave that. So I will get some number here. Next, here 143 minus question mark. I don't know this question mark. That, that has to be 4. So I will get one number here. I don't know that. I will put dash there. Now moving to next numbers. 168 minus 143. What is 168 minus 143? What is 168 minus 143? 160 minus 140. That is 160 minus 140. That is 20. Now 20 minus 3. That's 17. 17 plus remaining 8. 17 plus remaining 8. Even you can go with 17 plus 3, that is 20. 17 plus 3, that is 20. 20 plus 5, that is 25. This is called, yes, split and merge technique. This is called split and merge technique. Even if you are uh, good at uh, subtracting the numbers, you can directly say that 168 minus 143 is something 45. Okay, sorry, it is 25. So it is 25. You can go with split and merge technique or even you can go with direct subtraction. So split and merge technique can be used for bigger numbers or even some complex numbers. That uh, split and merge technique will be very helpful. Okay, now we got the difference as 25 here. Now if you observe these numbers 1, 4, 25. 1, 4, 25. How they are appearing? Yes, they are squares. 1 square is 1, 2 square is 4, this is 5 square. So here is a series, 1 square, 2 square, 5 squares. Okay, here I am missing with 2 numbers. They are, yes they are, 3 square, 4 square, 3 square, 4 square. Now, I will get 9 here because 3 square is 9, 4 square is 16. Now I got these numbers. The next step is to get these numbers, 
what I have to do? I have to use this number. Either this or this. How I can use this 9? Yes, I have to use this 9 with 180. What I have to do? I have to add 180 plus 9. That will give me this missing number. So what is 118 plus 9? 118 plus 9 will be? Yes, it is 127. So this is my missing number. Even you can go with go for cross checking. So if you take difference between 143 and 127, what is 120? 143 minus 140, sorry, 143 minus 127. Is it 16? Yes, it is there. 143 minus 127 will give me 16. So that says the 127 that we obtain is the right number. So go to option. First option itself is having 127. So first option is the right option. So this is how we solve this example by considering, considering the given series and using trial and error technique. And finally got the answer as 127. The first option is having 127. So that's a right option. Okay friends, now I will move to yes. Thank you.